Ask away. Try to penetrate the enigma that is me. Who were you in love with? That's not how the game works. I don't care the way the game works. Our Lord, he used to be married. Married? How did you hear that? No, you hear lots of things playing dice with Lannister soldiers. Another night, perhaps. Not another night. This night. It's not a pleasant story. Or maybe I will cry. I'm guessing the lady and I can tell more unpleasant stories than your lordship. So. I was 16. My brother Jamie and I were riding when we heard a scream. She ran out onto the road, clothes half torn off with two men on her heels. Jamie scared away the men easily enough while I wrapped her in my cloak. She was too scared to send off on her own, so while Jamie hunted down the rapers, I took her to the nearest inn and fed her. Her name was Taisha. She was a wheelwright's orphan, and she was hungry. Together, we finished off three chickens and a flagon of wine. Impossible as it seems, there was a time when I was unaccustomed to wine. I forgot how afraid I was around girls, how I was always waiting for them to laugh at me or look away embarrassed or ask me about my tall, handsome brother. I forgot about everything but Taisha. And somehow I found myself in her bed. For three chickens, I should hope so. <laughs> didn't last long. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. But she was good to me. She kissed me afterwards and sang me a song. And by morning, I was deep enough in love to ask for her hand. A few lies, a few gold coins, one drunken septum, and there you have it, man and wife. For a fortnight anyway, until the septum sobered up and told my father. Well, I imagine that was the end of all that. Not quite. First, my father had Jamie tell me the truth. The girl was a whore, you see. Jamie had arranged the whole thing. The road, the rapers, all of it. He thought it was time I had a woman. And after my brother confessed, my father brought in my wife and gave her to his guards. He paid her well. Silver for each man. How many whores command that kind of price? He brought me into the barracks and made me watch. By the end, she had so much silver that the coins were slipping through her fingers and rolling onto the floor. I would have killed the man who did that to me. You should have known she was a whore. <laughs> really? I was 16, drunk and in love. A girl who's almost raped doesn't invite another man into her bed two hours later. As I said, I was young and stupid. You are still young and stupid.